Hi all. So today I'm going to showcase the importance of 10.5 uh, future in Tableau. So one of the important feature is tooltip. So let me create a, a simple report here. So let's take uh, state wise or United States wise sales. So we do have 49 unknown. So let's go back to edit location. So don't filter out data. So let's go back to edit location. So default, I'm getting a country India. So because we do have only United States related uh, states here, let's type in United States. Click OK. So let me create a filled map here. Drag and drop state into color and uh, state into label. <coughs> So you can see here we do have a tooltip where it shows state name. If you are going to drag and drop sales into labels, showcase state by sales report. Correct. So generally we are going to create a dashboard. Let's let's say if you want to showcase state wise sales or if you want to showcase like uh, this particular state related information. Let's take particular year wise sales for that specific state. Or category by sales right we need to create a dashboard and uh, we need to perform some actions but generally we have a, a pretty much a flexible future in 10.5 so let me create one more sheet so let's take year by sales generally we do have order date let's create year by sales report so swap drag and drop the same order date into color to differentiate the color and uh, sales into labels so this is EOI sales and create one more sheet let's take category by sales and drop category into color and sales into labels <coughs> right so if you want to showcase complete information something like you need to create a dashboard we just drag and drop sheet one here and drop sheet two well, let's place here and drop sheet three go back to layout so you can make use of uh, the options where uh, <clears throat> if you want to go with the height and a width Right, you can check with all these options, but let's go back to dashboard. Right, generally, um, so now you can see we do have state related information, and uh, so you can see here. So we have uh, year wise sales and category wise sales. So let's go back to automatic. So generally you have an option to go for use as a filter right so when you click on a particular state it shows uh, that specific state wise information so again you have an option to go for use as a filter right so when you when you click on a specific state it shows that state wise information here right so <clears throat> but so one of the excellent future in tableau in 10.5 is uh, we don't want to place all these uh, extra sheets in the dashboard so one of the advantages uh, let's go back to sheet one or let's go back to sheet one here so tooltip so you have an option called insert sheets so this is what uh, uh, new feature in 10.5 so you can insert a sheet too or if you want you can rename something like a year by sales report so you can insert a sheet too and you have an option to go for maximum width you can alter this size right maximum width and maximum height right and uh, let's click ok so when you mouse over you can see so no need to create or no need to uh, place all the sheets related sheets in the dashboard straight away in the tooltip you are going to uh, see the related information let's take uh, uh, for a specific state right you can see every particular year wise sales so this is very interesting uh, future in tableau and if you want you can also add multiple sheets in tooltip so click on tooltip 
insert sheets sheet 3 click ok now you can see got it right so and sometimes you need to check if you have more number of labels right so let's go back to sheet 2 so make use of entire view so it helps a lot in the tooltip so how to make use of entire view because if you have more labels it's not possible to showcase all those but this is more flexible so just make use of uh, entire view so that it displays all the uh, labels let's uh, something like year by sales or a category by sales clear yeah thank you thanks for watching this video